This video is applicable for the removal and installation of Arnott's new front air shock replacement kit, SK2487, for the late model Cadillac Escalade, Chevrolet Tahoe, Suburban and Avalanche, and the GMC Yukon, including the Denali. Your vehicle may look different than the one used in this video. Please refer to the r installation manual that comes with your purchase for additional information and safety precautions. Removal Step 1. Disconnecting the battery To avoid the possibility of short circuits while working with electric components, Consult your owner's manual on how to disconnect your battery. Always wear safety glasses when doing automotive maintenance. Removal Step 2 Wheel Removal Start by removing the wheel's lug nuts. Once the lug nuts are removed, carefully take off the wheel. Removal Step 3 Lifting your vehicle. Use a secure lifting platform that is capable of raising the body separately from the wheels, lifting the vehicle body at the correct lifting points prescribed by the manufacturer. Removal Step 4 Disconnecting the shock sensor connectors. At the top of the shock, unplug the shock sensor connector and remove the top shock bolts. Please note, if the car is equipped with selectable ride, disconnect the real-time damping link rod from the sensor, grasp the connector lock tabs, then rotate the connector lock tabs counterclockwise until the connector is unlocked. Disengage the connector from the tenon by firmly pulling the connector up. Hold the tenon end with a wrench while removing the nut. Removal Step 5 Removing the shock assembly. Next, remove the shock assembly mounting bolts at the lower control arm. Then remove the shock assembly. Install. Step 1. Prepping for installation. Install the spring seat adapter, the OEM spring seat, and the bump stop cap onto the new shock absorber. Install the OEM coil spring and all the OEM upper mount parts, including the bump stop and the upper spring hat in their original positions. Install the new flange nut on the shock absorber top mount pin and tighten. Install Step 2 Installing the R Knot Shock. Install the new shock assembly. Then tighten the top bolts. It may be necessary to use a jack to install the new flange nuts on the lower T-bar mount. Once the flange nuts on the lower T-bar mount are installed, tighten. Remove the sensor connector plug and place it with the new plug and secure the cable.
Install Step 3 Installing the Wheel Reinstall the tire and tighten all the lug nuts and lower the vehicle. Install Step 4 Reconnecting the Battery To avoid the possibility of short circuits while working with electric components, consult your owner's manual on how to reconnect your battery. Installation completed. Congratulations! Lower the car to test drive and check the installation.